Good evening. An active lifestyle and healthy eating habits are the best way to lose weight, but sometimes we need to go a little further. The National Institute of Diabetes found that obesity occurs over time when you eat more calories than you consume. The balance between calorie intake and calories lost is different in each person. Factors include genetics, overeating, eating high-fat foods, and lack of exercise. Obesity increases the risk of diabetes, heart attack, stroke, arthritis, and certain cancers. If you are obese, losing at least 5 to 10% of your body weight can delay or prevent some of these diseases. If you cannot lose weight with a healthy diet and exercise, then surgery may be an option for you. You remove a portion of the stomach. You do not alter the anatomy. You do not create any kind of malabsorption. It's a safer, easier operation to perform with less long-term risks and complications. Surgery is recommended for men that weigh in excess of 100 pounds or more and for women with an excess of 80 pounds. If you weigh less and still have diabetes, heart disease, or sleep apnea, surgery still might be right for you. Obesity in and of itself is a disease that is very frequently associated with a multitude of other disease processes such as diabetes, high blood pressure, cholesterol problems, gallbladder problems, sleep apnea, um, many, many other issues that are part and parcel of the whole disease process. Reporting on Health Matters, I'm Lissa Hansen.